All right. Well, let's let's get a quick one in. Let's do a real fast one. Let's uh, let's hop on the Panthers. <laughs> right. Panthers uh, schedule here. Uh, apologize to your Panthers fans that are tuning in just for this portion. Um, it might be a rough year for you guys. Let's take a look at it. And none of this is personal. This is just how how life goes. Because you start off with the mail to the Atlanta Falcons. We've already crossed that bridge. You're right. <laughs> and okay. we then week two here. You move on to Derek Carr. You lose that game. We crossed that bridge. Smart. And then week three, you got to play Geno Smith. Oh my God, you're zero and three. Good night. Then you got to play the the, the Thuggins of Kurt. That's that's zero and four. Got to play Jared Goff after that. You're zero and five. Then you got to play the Dolphins after that. You're zero and six. Good night. Yeah. Now this is the one game here: Texans and Panthers. Yeah, this one is interesting. This one. Is really a battle of the draft picks, right? It really is. And I think CJ Stroud showed why he should have went number one. And you moved on and said, mm. Good night. Mm. Uh, I'm going with you. I feel like <laughs> it's just... so good night. It's... And then, luckily, though, I think you get a win against the Colts. I like okay. to say, I'm, I'm, I'm not a Richardson. He said, I don't. I'm not a Richardson believer just yet. But I think Bryce Young, you like I said, you got to get one win in there, one and seven. It got to be against the Colts because those next few weeks, those next two weeks, you got to play Justin Fields. That's another loss. You won and eight. Is, that is another loss. And then you got to play Dak. Ooh, one and nine. You done lost two back to back. And then you get to play the Titans. So then you move to two and nine on the season. Now, I'm going to give them the – hey. That is my first win on the books. Let's okay. shout out. Get excited, Panthers fans, for the officially <laughs> crossed the line of not being skunked on the full season. Right, because you get, you get a mm. good dub on the Titans. And then you get to beat the Panthers. I mean, no. I'm sorry, the Panthers, you get to beat the Buccaneers. <laughs> no. He's both so they're, they're trash. Not the Bucks. They're not beating the Bucks. You called it correctly and you didn't even know it. Uh, they are right. Well, no, because I got them sweeping the bucks as the bucks. Are just, oh. it, we're talking the batter of the dumpsters. Right. Uh, so you get that dub, you lose to Derek Carr, so you're three and nine, and then you lose to the Falcons, then you're three and ten. Good night, and then you pay the Packers, and then you might get a fifth, you fourth win. Yeah, you get I'm giving wins. them a win on the Packers. That was uh, <clears throat> gonna tell them get excited. The, Four uh, and ten. Mm. Four and ten. And then you lose again because you got to play Jacksonville on Christmas oh, before the New Year. So now you're four and eleven. But there's hope on the horizon because you play the Bucks again and you move to uh, what is that? What I got you at? Oh, that's eleven losses. You, you, yeah. You so you you're five and eleven on the season. Five and eleven. Mm, that's. That is absolutely more positive than my two and fifteen that I currently have them at. Jeez, um, Louise, Panthers fans, that was actually a murderous schedule. I was gonna say garbage team. This is and, unbelievable. And shout out to one of the best things that ever came out came out of Cleveland, Bone Thugs and Harmony, because that right that schedule right there is Mo Murder, Mo Murder. Good. That was not fair. I was not. Ex- I honestly thought I, I thought you were right. I I thought about that five win mark was probably about where it was going to end up for the Panthers until I looked at that murderous schedule. <laughs> The Raiders got dealt like that as well. I don't know what happened there, but this is a real close race of, you know, being a bad team with a really hard schedule between these two. I think the Panthers ran into a worse situation looking at that schedule. That was unfair. Absolutely unfair. Brutal. 